Rafael Russo of NAFA talks about the 2013 INE Educational and Networking Opportunities. Um, but we have over 60 educational sessions focusing more primarily again, what we did is go back and ask the members, what are your core problems that you're dealing with this year and you expect to be dealing with in 2013? Cost cutting, number one. So we're looking at ways to save money for you and your operations. Fuel, again, cost cutting, but also alternative fuels. What are some of the new things you're doing? Technology, what are some of the new technologies that you're implementing in your fleet? And safety, because you know, not, not just distracted driving, but also safety technology. So those are kind of the four themes that will be playing out throughout the day in the 60 sessions. Each day is going to have its own keynote speaker and not just a fun keynote speaker. It's going to be somebody who's relevant to the industry. So we've invited um, the president of Ford Motor Company. Since Ford is a huge supporter of NAFA, huge player in the fleet industry, invited them to come. We've invited the CEO of Federal Express to come and deliver a keynote speaker and kind of give a, give a talk about what Federal Express is doing in alternative fuels. We've invited some um, folks from, from down in Washington election year. We're not sure whether they're going to be a Democrat or Republic, Republican, uh, but we've had somebody there. And then Friday will probably be um, more of a kind of a motivational speaker, but with the idea being that these are going to be recognizable names. You're going to see value in, in who those speakers are and know, yeah, I want to go and hear um, Alan Mulally speak at, at NAFA in, in 2013. He hasn't promised that he'll be there, but certainly the invitation is there. So, and then again, we're also very cognizant of the fact that this industry is, is all about networking. And it's all about people meeting people. Yes, you have to be educated, but yes, it's all about the business that you can do while you're having a drink with someone or while you're sharing dinner with somebody or while you're at a conversation at lunch. So uh, we've expanded the networking opportunity as well. There's coffee breaks, there's meals, there's a couple of different receptions. And then at the end of every night, we're gonna have kind of an after party.